Good morning and welcome to the Lasham Daily Briefing for the Club Operations, Sunday 18th of August 2024. So synoptically then, this is midnight last night, uh, got huge low pressure right over Iceland, which is... Uh, I've got a series of fronts on them, as you can see. Uh, but we're relatively uh, calm down our part of the country in, in a in a little wedge of high pressure here. Uh, no fronts immediately over us in the south of the country. Uh, they've certainly got some top cover of uh, north and maybe to the west. Um, and hopefully we should be left with quite a pleasant, um, unstable, uh, sorable day with a slight westerly wind. Um Spot winds are indicated today, flying winds are about 270, 15 knots, there, thereabouts. And the cloud, so this is a cloud cover associated with that, with that front. And literally, uh, in the last hour or fire or so, it's burnt off in the southeast of the country. And hopefully we'll continue to do so. Let's just uh, get a refresh on that. Interestingly, it's got Saturday down the bottom there. I'm not 100% certain what's going on here, but uh, it's certainly for today, I believe. This is the top cover we have over us, and it is slowly burning away, and uh, uh, we should be relatively clear here later on today. Uh, rain radar, there's no real rain in the local area. Um, a couple of little showers perhaps out to the west uh, as that the uh, that upper cloud, the thick upper cloud drops a few bits and pieces on us, but otherwise we should be clear uh, north and to the northeast. Uh, Met forecast uh, rain today is showing pretty well clear uh, throughout the day. Bentworth is then sowing uh, sunshine and clouds. Pleasant day, actually. Top temperature today around about 22. Uh, winds nine knots or so direct down the runway from the west. Uh, come gusts a bit later on to about 20, perhaps, which may be a problem for the finishers later. And with a sudden index factor of six. So there, everyone is very keen that this uh, this top cover is going to clear. Uh, GFS is giving us top temperature today of 22 degrees and a viewpoint down at eight. Uh, view outside the window as we speak. We've got this top cover. You see bits and pieces start to break up now. So as soon as you get a bit of sun through there, I think it'll dissipate quite rapidly. And current temperatures at Lasham are 14 degrees with a dew point down at 11. And the temperatures are very, very slowly rising at the moment, which you'd expect with this top cover. Uh, Dave is indicating today it's going to be either blue or shallow queue at 3,500 by 11. Uh, but by early afternoon, 4,500 feet uh, with some queue and some streeting. So very good conditions. Um, up to 5,000 feet, perhaps. And the best areas around us, south coast, Midlands, East Anglia and south, well, east. OK, Odium is indicated today, uh, 12 knots from the west. Uh, no TAF at the weekends. And Farber is indicating five knots from the west-southwest. And they're talking about scattered clouds at 4,000 feet later today. Top Mentio uh, indicated uh, distance to fly today. It's all very good. All that green area is certainly uh, good for where our guys are going to be going. And if I run through the thermal prediction, so this is at uh, nine o'clock this morning, uh, blue. Uh, by 10 o'clock, a few cumulus at about 3,200. And the queue is going to continue. This is through 11 o'clock local, 12 o'clock. And talking about 4,500 foot queue around about uh, 12 o'clock local. And if I run that through the day, possibly going a bit blue later on, but with sort of 5,000 foot uh, thermals by three in the afternoon. Sky sight indicates a similar distance for cross country. And if I run through the actual local forecast, we've got this lower cloud, which is burning off at the moment. And they're indicating by around about 11.30, we should have 4,000 foot cloud base queue. Uh, thinning out slowly as the day goes on um, with tops around a queue base around about 4,000 foot uh, AGL. Yeah, well, that seat back okay, so. came out yesterday. And then if I run through what no terms for today, we've got... Uh, Obviously, we've got our cells 24. 22 is Barton Station, the live firing, the usual thing. Uh, 27, Uphaven Telephone Change, 28. Uh, parachute dropping at Farnborough today between 11.45 and 12.15 local. 
34 paramotor uh, paramotoring at Farringdon, surfaces of 2,500 all day. 38 is the usual Otmore. 41 parachute display at Northampton. 43 um, is the Husbos comps. The parachute display, by the way, at Northampton is from 1500 to 1530 local. 45 aerobatics contest at Leicester all day. And 46 multiple paragliders at North Luffnam, surface to two and a half thousand feet. So set up an operation for the day then. Uh, the regional competitions are on, so I'll brief a little bit later on about the club operations. This top cover is burning off to become Q base four and a half thousand foot by midday. Uh, there'll be a light northwesterly or westerly wind all day. We're going to set up on a comp two seven operation. And uh, don't forget special rate aerotos only for winch current guys uh, to receive that special rate. Got five K21s available all day, one K21 on trial flights, one K21 on the booking system. Chris Gibson will be instructing in that. Uh, three K13s and remaining K21s are all available and all single-seaters booked. Uh, general reminder about the buggies, please. Any visitors that uh, are around here today were not insured to carry people not in seats and so no transportation on the rear of any of the buggies, please. And the simulator is available if it's required. OK, pictorially, then Chris Gibson's got uh, someone in the morning and the afternoon, so he's going to be fairly busy. We've got the Sunday evening aerobatic course, which will be on. I think the weather's going to be fine for that. All the discuses are away at competitions or this competition. A uh, few K21 and K13 slots available today, and all the single seaters are booked. And we've got a few people on the casual list, which is nice to see. So... Uh, the comp will be grinning on runway 27. We'll be in the same place as we were yesterday, there, thereabouts. Uh, it's a club operation, Grass North, and we'll be doing right-hand circuits to land there. And if I explain a little bit better with this uh, chart here, basically anywhere north of the buffer zone is for use of the club gliders only. So by definition, that is any glider taking off from the club that is not part of the competition. We have only got the grass north area. To the south of the buffer zone is used totally and exclusively by the uh, competitions, and that includes the main runway. OK, so we're going to be on, on runway 27 today, all day. So it'd be right hand circuits onto runway 27, landing grass north, either short, in the middle or even long if you need to down there. Don't be surprised, however, later on, if you may possibly see competition gliders returning and landing on 09 long. That's why we've got this buffer zone. OK, we're going to be north. And all the competition are going to be south. So we've got three runways run here, the Tarmac, Grass Centre and Grass South. They're all clearly marked from the air. You can't miss them. Uh, the competition will be coming in if, on marginal glides on Tarmac and Grass Centre on 09 and landing long. Any guys with excessive height and speed will be able to pull up and do a southerly circuit to land on 27 Grass South long. OK, no club gliders on any of the runways south of the buffer zone okay hopefully that's clear enough if there's any confusion about that please come and see me i'll be out on the airfield i'll be doing a little bit of towing while we'll see comps going on but otherwise i'll be running the club grid so i shall see you all out there shortly bye